that it was an unbelievable atmosphere and good for College of Charleston, an opportunity to get to the NCAA tournament. Guys, who are, is score for Marcus Perrier. On the rebound from a guy who's just in the NCAA, gets his first pro point. Leo Fitzgerald threw it at the net. Marcus Perrier cleans up the rebound in front for Perrier. It will be his sixth goal of the season. We mentioned Leo Fitzgerald making the play, threw it on net. Halverson let up the rebound, and Perrier backhands it in. Congratulations, Leo Fitzgerald, first pro period. Picks up a point right away. He's at Javeri, but now not in control. Zajac got a turnover, played it to Whitney in front, deflected back to the near side. Whitney turned it over on the far side to Node. Now it's back to Whitney, backhand in front. Zajac, backhand move was stopped by Halverson. Zajac tried to outweigh Halverson, and he made a save. Now to the net, Chen, a shot, save. Rebound loose at the side of the net. It's still loose. After Pop Rabbits, near wall, hit by Bindelis, played it behind the net. Prop of Estes keeps it in, far point. Worked down the far wall, kept in by Lidal. Basaraba finds Prop of Estes. He's got plenty of room, he shoots, save. Milner, rebound, score. The Swamp Rabbits put it in on the rebound. And it's a power play goal for Greenville to tie the game. Matt Propovasis again didn't get the goal, but he took the initial shot. And it's going to be the first career goal for JT Hankey playing in front of the net on the power play for Greenville. Puck got behind Milner, and Hankey able to sweep it into the back of the net. Very on the red line, deflected away, and now Chen takes it the other way. It's a breakaway for Cozen. He leads Whitney into the zone. Whitney, a shot was stopped by Halverson. Glove save by Brandon Halverson, his best save of the night. Bad change by Greenville, left the Stingrays wide open. They knew it and recognized it. Cozen left Whitney into the zone. Whitney tried to go glove side and Halverson able to keep it out, big save. Prop of Estes on the near wall, four and a half minutes gone by in the second. Still a 1-1 score, a lot of speed for JT Hankey. He gets by Federico, and a save, Milner, a second save, and the rebound loose, and now the Rays have it. It's Dylan Marganeri going the other way. Marganeri into the offensive zone, drops it off for Devin, centering past Camerata, he stopped. What a save by Halverson with the glove. Camerata tried to go glove side on Brandon Halverson, another big save for the Swamp Rabbits goal center. 15-11 to go in the second. Great saves for both goalies on both sides. Yeah, it sure is, and, and if the Stingrays end up uh, not winning this game, you can look back on those two saves that Halverson just. Cozen able to pick up the rebound, and Chen will move past one man, but turn it over. And now Chen lost the glove, and he's got to get back defensively. Here's Evan Jasper a shot, and he scores. Yeah. What a shot of the near corner from Evan Jasper. And the Swamp Rabbits have a 2-1 lead with 7.38 remaining in the second period. Greenville has come on over the last couple minutes. And Evan Jasper keeps putting points on the board for the Swamp Rabbits. Beats Milner with that wrist shot. Yeah, really nice wrist shot there. And uh, people who didn't think it went in, it hit, uh, it hit the water bottle behind the net and knocked it off. So no doubt that was a goal and what a Rebound Chen, back to Leach, keeps in on the line. Barely held it in. Now Zane Jack, cross ice pass for Chen. Leach fires, save made, rebound! Save made by Halverson. And where is it? They blow it dead. Fans were cheering, light never came on. Halverson fell backwards, but the whistle blown. One minute gone by the third, one minute to go on the Jimmy John's Freaky Fast Power Play Rays. Moving around well, almost a shame that to change off that unit, they did a good job on that on that uh, couple plays. Yeah, best looking uh, minute on the power play we've seen all night there. They were getting shots on net, Leach, Joey Leach providing most of the firepower, and then guys getting in front of the net and uh, getting some traffic in front of Halverson. I mean, tonight, if he sees the puck, he's gonna make the save, and you saw that on the rebound that he made, it looked like he made a glove save there, it was a great as he save. was falling backwards. Back holding. Threw it to the middle for Chen. In front was blocked. Rebound kept in by Leach with the long reach. Out of the far side, Zane Jack. Leach calling for it. Now Leach with it. Faked on a shot. Chen a shot. Score! Mike Chen on the power play. And South Carolina ties the game at two with 11.43 to go in the third. Second goal of the season for Mike Chen. And it was Leach and Chen making it happen on the power play. Yeah, just Chen just kept cheating over and cheating over and cheating over and shot it wide of the net. And now Patrick Gall for South Carolina. Long pass, here's Roberto on a breakaway. Roberto tried to move the backhand and it was blocked away. And now here come the Swamp Rabbits the other way. Cross Holding on to the puck. 
Yeah, this penalty kill is looking like they're the best penalty kill in the uh, ECHL on this shift. Basaraba threw it in front, and just as you say that, and they score. That. Evan Jasper with his third point of the night, his second goal. He was wide open in front of Parker Milner. And the Swamp Rabbits on the power play have taken the lead three to two with 2.18 remaining in the third. Evan Jasper's been the story tonight along with Brandon Halverson. And now the Stingrays with 2.18 remaining got to try to get back in this game. Yeah, and that was the old broadcaster jinx right there. Just back. came around the corner, two players came with him. Nobody picked up the forward coming down the slot and just a pretty easy tap. Trying to get it back, he does. Whitney circles to the near part of the circle. Whitney in front for Devin, a stuff in was fanned on, and now the Swamp Rabbits clear, a rolling puck that Bindelis will have to chase after with 20 seconds to go in the game. Bindelis will skate it forward, 15 seconds to go. Leach into the zone, Whitney back to Leach, backhand shot, save, rebound, side of the net was stopped, Whitney holds on, six seconds to go in the game, his shot was blocked. Fitzgerald with it. His shot deflected wide of the net. And that'll do it for this one as the Swamp Rabbits clear. Final score, Greenville three, South Carolina two.